the first priority for like positive modifications rather than just the removing of the bulkhead but actually adding something new is going to be putting windows in these back doors so I can see to reverse a bit easier because I have to reverse to get into my space at home. Here I'm just removing I'm going to attempt to remove at least uh, what the previous owner had put in this little ply lining for the, for the window. Just want to mastic it in place. Thanks, mate. Wood screws, ideal. So both panels are off now, that's the second one down and I'm just clearing off this horrible mastic residue that the previous owner left on there for me. Thanks mate. And <laughs> on this door I've got a, a helper because this is a tricky job this one. Hey, how you getting on Elle? Good. It's hard isn't it? Yeah. What are you doing? Um, so I'm taking it off and it takes a really long time. That's the size you're doing them didn't it? Very, very hard and yeah. very, very stiff. But you're being very helpful, aren't you? Yes. Good lad, good lad. So Sammy's helped me with the bulkhead and uh, you're helping me with the back doors. Nice. Good boy. I did the barn doors and felt like I was on a bit of a roll. I just taken the ply lining off the side uh, door here. So um, that's kind of... Oh. In terms of priority for me, for windows, firstly I want to be able to see out the back so I can drive a little bit easier. Then I want to get the side door on the window uh, opened up and then last but never least will be this side, the um, kind of like the passenger side or driver side, sorry, rear uh, window, which is where the passengers will be in the back. They'll be set on that side. So yeah, my goodness, um, lots to do and lots to learn over the next few weeks. And a thank you, like I genuinely mean it's a massive thank you to everyone out there in the camper van sort of fraternity or community or whatever you want to be called, um, who makes videos and tutorials because you're enabling numpties like me who know nothing have to be brave enough to give this a go. So um, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. morning we are out on a family work party clearing the van we have set up a little trailer tent here and uh, trailer tent no barn door tent that's what it is um, just put a tarpaulin over the top and put some bungees on it and we've been removing ply lining from the walls and just start taking it out of the floor it's so mucky underneath like 10 years worth of filth mucky so it's really good to do and necessary to do, it's not very pleasant to do. Did you say you're the first one, Em? Yeah, and the first one standing on here. First one standing. Are you the first one dancing in there? Yeah. No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sorry. Music stops when I got the video on. <laughs> it's, uh, Uncle Matt helping to lay a rubber mat. Thank you, Matt. That's what Yay. Brothers are for, Very good. 
Look at this, what a little transformation. It's nuts how much different just laying a roll out, not even fitting it properly. We just cut around roughly on the edge with scissors, but um, it's fitted so well. I bought the roll in my mind, thinking I'd roll, roll it sideways, but it turns out I've measured the band slightly wrong, and it's big enough to fit widthways, basically. So, um, yeah. happy days. You like it, Elle? Yeah. This is not Jordan Peterson, here to tell you to clean up your room. And once you've done that, subscribe to Dave Hellier's channel on YouTube. Thanks.